Hey guys, this is Mr. Sal. We're going to look at this problem that was sent in by a student on how to solve it. A cookie recipe takes two and a half cups of chocolate chips. You only have an eighth cup. How many eighth cups of chocolate chips will you need to use for this recipe? Now one thing we should point out for this one is it's asking how many of something we need for something else, right? How many... Uh, how many of something goes into something else? So just to clarify, this is really what it's asking, right? How many eighth cups are in two and a half cups? And the reason I point this out is because it's a division problem. How many of these eighths, so again, that would be our divisor, are in two and a half? So it's really two and a half divided by one eighth. Now, you could have just taken one eighth and added it to itself enough times until you had two full cups and a half cup. Um, but if we do this with the division like this, then it may end up being a little bit shorter for us, okay? So the first thing I would want to do is take this two and a half and change it into an improper fraction. So that would be two times two, which is four, and then add one the numerator, which is five. So it's really five halves divided by one eighth. Now something we should remember from the unit that this was for is that we don't actually divide the fractions, right? We end up multiplying them. So I'm going to change the multiplication to, I'm sorry, the division to multiplication by reciprocating this fraction, which would then be 8 over 1. So I end up with 5 halves times 8, and we could, if we wanted to, cross-simplify this by simplifying the 2 and the 8, right, because 8 divided by 2 would be 4, and 2 divided by 2 is 1, and now I can multiply these together to get my final answer, which will be in, I guess, scoops in this case. So I got 5 times 4, which is 20, and in the denominator is 1 times 1, so I'm just going to show this as 20, and again, just, just so we don't get confused with... Uh, something like this right here, one-eighth cups, uh, I would get rid of that and simply redefine it as 20 scoops. So it looks like it would be 20 scoops in order to make two and a half cups from an eighth cup. Now you could check this as well, right? So 20 scoops is 28 scoops. Eight scoops would be one full cup, right? So 16 scoops would be two full cups and then four scoops, four eighths, would be one full half. So it does check off. Alright, you guys, that does it for this video. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.